still have that off and on batch of rain and storms this morning. It's more widespread though as we get into the afternoon. So here's the middle part of the day. I think we're pretty quiet, but we keep with the clouds. Those clouds will stay with us uh, right on through the afternoon as well. We bubble up a storm in and around Sneedville for parts of the two o'clock hour. More come through through 3:30, 4 o'clock uh, at times. Those will bubble up, rain themselves out. Moving forward, another batch comes through at 730. That's the story of the day today. We put that coverage at 40% for you really through that five o'clock hour. So once we get into the middle and latter part of the day, that's when we'll increase some of those rain chances. And the forecast where you live shows us 86 in Knoxville to 84 in Pigeon Forge. Kingston's at 85. It's 80 in Crossville to 79 in Jamestown, 82. <clears throat> Excuse me, in La Folla. Overnight tonight, periods of rain will be with us once again. 70 for the start of the day coming up on Tuesday. More showers and storms with us for the start of the day on Tuesday. We'll track those for you then. Light in nature through the middle part of the morning and then in the afternoon we start to see more widespread rain that's with us too. Three, four o'clock in the afternoon with some heavy downpours around Morristown, back over Rome Mountain as well. Pushing forward into the six o'clock time frame, we'll see some breaks, but still seeing some of that with us. The future rainfall going right on through next week or this week shows us by the time all is said and done. We'll pick up another inch in most locations and some of you could get closer to that two if not three by the time all is said and done. Definitely welcome rainfall with us here for the next week. We keep that 60% coverage with you really Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday in the low 80s for the uh, afternoon highs. Overnight lows very close to 70. When I step out of the way, you'll see a repeat situation going on into Friday as well. 60% coverage going into the weekend. We pull it back just a little bit to 20% with just spotty storms and we increase the temperatures as well back up into the mid to upper 80s by the time all is said and done. So at least this week we'll have some good soaking rains to help us with our dry situation that we've had here over the last little while.